guys know what time it is you clicked on the video you already know what's gonna happen about a week ago i made a video about this exact skin the eternal aug requiem skin releasing in blood strike last week we had a first look at what the skin looks like what the effects look like but today is the day where we're gonna open up the stash we're gonna see how much gold is gonna cost us we also have some pre-order vouchers so if we get really really lucky we might get it with that but that's very very unlikely not gonna lie you have to be extremely lucky for that but anyway, without further ado, let's hop into the video, let's open up the stash, let's put this baby to the test, and let's see how much gold I had to spend to get it. Let's go. Very quick disclaimer before we hop into the opening of this skin. If you are aged under 18, I highly encourage you to seek guidance and advice from your parents or a legal guardian if you wish to obtain skins from stashes in Bloodstrike. The skins shown in this video are obtainable by opening loot boxes, and they are considered as gacha. All right, here we are, guys. We're going to be opening up this Requiem stash. We have 10 vouchers that we got from the pre-order. And as you guys can see, they actually revamped this, like, stash system a little bit. They gave it a new look. I don't think it actually changes the way that, um, you know, you get a chance of winning anything. Uh, but anyway, let's hope we get lucky. Let's see how much we're going to have to spend. And uh, let's go. Let's go. We got a long way to go. We're going to go for five pulls with these tickets. You never know. You know, that's what I keep telling myself. Okay. Not too bad. It's okay. These are just the vouchers. So, you know, I wasn't expecting anything. That's okay. There we go. We get some more points. All right. Now, for the next pull, I think I want to... Wanna, oh, wait. I think what I want to do is we're going to switch it up to do a 50 pull all at once. So, 1.5k. Let's just go with it. Right? Let's just go with it. Here we go. We are not skipping, though. We are not skipping. I told myself that we can't be skipping because that would be bad luck. Okay, we got the minigun. We got the INP. That's kind of crazy. Dude, my heart raced for a second that I got the <laughs> Eternal, but we didn't. It's basically the deluxe reveal. And the deluxe reveal, honestly, like this deluxe really, really looks good. It very much reminds me um, like the um, Eternal, uh, sorry, the Eternal Liberator skin that we had for the Scar. Uh, looks very, very similar, very similar effects, but I don't know, the kill broadcast actually looks kind of crazy. Or wait, this is actually the number, sorry, that you have. Let's see what you actually get with the deluxe version. Okay, so you have a kill broadcast, tracer ammo, hit effect. M account, okay, inspection, which will be the same. New look, okay, that looks very, very sick. Then you also have a kill animation, which looks really, really cool, not gonna lie. You have an emote, which is, you know, a yellow version of what we already had. And then we also get a special loot crate, Dawn Light. Okay, that's pretty cool. Really, really hoping that I'm gonna get that one, but I wouldn't count on it. All right, we're gonna go back to um, 300 pulls. Let's go. Let's go. Slow and steady. Okay, slow and steady. That's the way to go. I think 150 pulls is a little bit too, like, not enough, you know? Too, uh, like, 150 pulls is going to be too slow. But 300 pulls, we can do it. We've actually gotten a lot already, I just realized. Um, because as you guys can see over here, we can actually see what we got already. So we have gotten the minigun. We've gotten the INP. We've also gotten the diving trail. So, um... I don't know if that's a good sign or if that's a bad sign. I don't know. Uh, but we're going to keep going here. I don't want to do skips, guys. I don't do want to do skips. All right, let's see. We have about 100 points as well. So you guys know that these red items, uh, the more you collect them, uh, the more you can redeem them. And then eventually you'll be able to claim the skin anyway, even if you don't pull for it. So that is okay. We're going to keep going here now. I think we have gone over 2k uh, gold spent here. Um, yeah, we're just gonna keep it going. Uh, that is very, very unlucky. Only one, one tiny little things over there. Damn, man. At least give me like 10, 110 in like a pull, you know? That'd be worth it. All right, there we go. We get some more. We're gonna keep going. By the way, I didn't even see what is in the stash, but we'll have, we're gonna have a look at that in a second anyway. All right, we get some more upgrade points, some more, uh, pulls over here. To, for, for the time being, this is not looking too hot. This is not looking too hot, but it's okay. It's it's okay. This might be the first time that I'm not going to pull an Eternal. 
um, because previously I've been very, very lucky when I'm opening these eternal stashes that I always pull the gun. But you can't always be lucky, right? So maybe this time around, this is going to be the unlucky stash. I hope not. I hope not. I mean, we haven't spent that much yet. So, I mean, it's still looking okay. Uh, we're looking at 3k spend right now. We've gotten two legendaries, um, a diving trail, and a lot of upgrade points. All right, we got more upgrade points. Not a problem. All right, we're going to keep going here. We're going to keep going here. All right, we're about at 4k spent, 4k gold, which is about 40 USD. Okay. Oh, man, it's not looking too good. It's not looking too hot, guys. All right, all right, all right. We, 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 need, we need a break. We need a strategy. We have 200 redeem points. Let's see what the redeem points are for, by the way. We have the Eternal Aug Requiem, which is this one. You also have the Deluxe version, but, you know, getting up to 4K points is literally almost impossible. We have the Loot Crate that we still need to get, or how I like to call them, the Dead Boxes. We have a cute ornament as well. We have some stickers. We have an avatar, which looks good. We have some uh, upgrade points. Uh, over here and then we also have the camo for this stash and i gotta say i really really like this camo um it looks very very cool i very very much like this camo we've gotten a lot of red camos lately i don't know why but um out of all of the red camos this is probably the best looking one not gonna lie to you guys all right there you go gotta click a few times and now let's go <laughs> let's go guys oh, i don't want to look I don't want to look anymore. Come on, man. Okay. We've gotten the loot crate or the dead box. Okay, okay, okay. What just happened? It like randomly went onto the deluxe version. Alright. Here we go, guys. Please, bro. Just give me the eternal. <laughs> uh, we've actually done, done a lot of spins now. Yeah, we are down like almost 5k and we haven't gotten it yet. So, um, you know, we're going to keep going. We're going to keep going. Obviously, we want to spend as, le as, as, as little as possible so we can, you know, still upgrade the gun. All right, here we go again. <sighs> Bro, this is like nerve-wracking, you know? This is actually nerve-wracking. Dude, we are not getting anything right now. It's actually kind of crazy. All right, you know what? I'm going to switch it up. We're going to do one... Uh, 1.5k pull. Let's go for it. Okay. Come on. Give me some luck. Here we go. Boom. That's a big pull. That's a big pull. We could potentially get it in this pull. I really, really hope so. That would be beautiful. Oh, man. We didn't get it. We didn't get it. That was a really, really, really big pull. Uh, we're still not even like... We're, we're still about like halfway through this oh my god bro this is actually looking bad you know for almost like 7k gold spend we only have like half of the points which is not great okay like we we have to pull this we have to pull this all right we're gonna do another 1.5k pull and see how that goes let's go oh man it's not looking good guys it's not looking good no bro that is 3k that i just spent and we are like we've gotten nothing out of that pretty much oh man that is not good at all all right i mean at this point we just keep going man we just keep going we're gonna do another 1.5k pull and after that we're gonna switch back to 300 pulls if we don't get it because this is getting crazy bro this is getting crazy that's like 4.5k down in like less than two minutes no bro are you serious we have spent 10k and we haven't gotten it yet all right that is unlucky all right we're gonna go back to actually you know what i'm gonna do like one 150 i believe i believe at this point we're trying all of the strategies out to see what or where the luck is you know we gotta try out different pulls okay that didn't work all right let's go back to 300 pulls let's get it Ah, bro, come on, man. I still need to upgrade, you know? I still need to upgrade, man. 
Not like this, man. You know what the thing is that really sucks? If you have to get the gun by not pulling it, it means that you literally cannot unlock other things in the stash, right? So if you pull it and you still have, like, let's say 500 points, you can actually use those points to get upgrade points. So it's not entirely, like, a waste, right? Um, but anyway, let's keep going. Let's keep going. I'm committed now, so we have to keep going, you know? I'm committed, so... We'll that's it, man. Oof, 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 oof. Alright. We're almost at 500 points. So we are going to be able to soon claim the Eternal no matter what. Oh, I accidentally skipped, by the way. Whoopsie. That's bad luck. Alright, we, we need some more pulls. That is crazy, guys. We are... I don't know what's going on today. Like, uh, we are very unlucky. We ran out of luck, guys. We ran out of luck. Like, a while ago, I was a bit too lucky. And now we ran out of luck. Alright, uh, I think let's just do like one 1.5k pull, 50 pills, let's go, all at once, let's get it. Just give me the gun, bro, just give me. Come on. Bro, we still didn't get it? Oh, bro, that's crazy. That's a 1.5k pull and like I didn't even get like a single like 10 stack out of that. Alright, uh, so let's see. We are almost at um, 500 points. So we're going to tone it back down to 300 gold, okay? 300 gold, here we go. And hopefully we get enough points to like uh, just get the skin, really. That is what we're now hoping for. Alright, there we go. 501 points. We're going to go ahead and claim this skin out of the shop like this. Unfortunately, we didn't get lucky and we didn't get to pull, so there is that. But we do get the skin now, so we're going to go ahead and equip that. I'm going to see how much I'm going to upgrade it. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, I don't want to top up more gold, um, so let's see what we can do with this upgrading. All right, guys, so I decided to upgrade the gun up until level 5 and not level 6, but we're going to have a look at what this gun actually looks like and if it's worth buying for you to have a first impression of what the iron sights look like and what the effects actually look like. So let's have a look. This is the gun. This is the basic iron sight if you have it fully maxed out to level 5, so it looks very, very cool. The only remark that I have with this, and uh, this is very similar to the Eternal Scar skin, is is that this is a red transparent um, dot which makes it very very hard to track in a light environment so let's have a look at what that looks like when I'm shooting there you see and as you guys can see I'm gonna do this again and then I'm gonna zoom in so you guys can see how hard it is to see the bullets like I'm literally losing track of where the dot is on this iron side. So in a way, this is actually pay to lose. But anyway, let's see what the other scope looks like because there is a scope that comes along with the skin. It is a two times scope. So let's have a look. This actually looks super, super clean. And I'm a huge fan of this like scope design. I actually really, really like this. But again, same problem as with the default iron side. The kind of like a red transparency makes it very very hard to track your bullets especially with the effects that are on the gun so let's have a look yeah very very hard to see but it's okay all right now let's have a look at what the weapon inspect looks like Yeah, bro. Like, not gonna lie to you guys. That inspect looks insane. There's also a reload animation, by the way. There you go. Just to, like, showcase it to you guys. Um, but yeah, that looks really, really good. Honestly, I'm showcasing you guys the skin as it is. Uh, just so you can have an ID. Whether or not you want to spend your gold on this skin. Um, just remember that it can get very, very costly. As you guys saw with my opening. Some people get really, really lucky. And they get it, like, within less than 5k gold. And then they can actually upgrade it nicely. Um, but these eternal skins are a bit pricey so keep that in mind if you want to go for this and yeah usually we would dive into some gameplay but this time around we're not gonna dive into some gameplay because that gameplay with this eternal og is gonna be reserved for the mobile gameplay i didn't forget about it guys it's coming very soon i'm cooking something up so stay tuned for that thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next one Bye bye